A home movie is a great way to document events like your daughter's birthday party, a friend's wedding, or a family trip. Why shouldn't editing a home movie be just as much fun as shooting it? The Video Studios Movie Wizard makes video editing easy and quick by doing most of the work for you. In a few simple steps you can now create home movies that everyone will love to watch. So let's import videos from an AVCHD hard disk drive camcorder. Connect the camcorder to your computer via a USB 2 cable. Turn on the camcorder and switch to the play mode. Launch Video Studio, make sure you've got the 16x9 checked and select the movie wizard. So I'm going to go insert digital media and this is if you have a DVD camcorder or video that's already been captured. Right, so here we can see our clips and we can preview them. Right, so this is video that we shot on a family trip to go ballooning. I can select my clips here, any number that I like, and preview them. And then I go import. Now all the video clips are added to the media clip list. If needed, you can trim the unwanted parts from the beginning and end of each clip by dragging the handles here. Or you can use the jog slider to find the position where you want to start and say mark in and mark out. Right, now we click next. And here we have our templates. So we're going to select a HD home movie template. And I'm going to click on this one. A movie with a template will give you an opening sequence with titles and music. then it will you have your video edited with music and in the end it will show a final closing clip. We can click here to select the duration of our movie. It can fit to the background music or we can specify duration. Uh, we can just say okay fit the video duration here. Now there are two animated titles in a theme template and we can modify them like this. There, we can adjust the fonts like that, the text color, and the position. You can even rotate it a little bit. And then on the music side, we can replace our music if we want to, or we can just keep the music that the template suggested to us and then here we can adjust the relative volume of the music versus the audio that's on the video so that the music is louder. Alright if we're happy with our project we click next. Now here we can choose to create a video file in various formats to save on our hard drive and play back from there but most people of course would want to create a DVD so we're going to click there select DVD and wait for the DVD authoring module to open alright so we see our home movie is automatically inserted here as a clip in the clip list again make sure that we've got 16 by 9 aspect ratio selected and now we can choose to add chapters to our video So let's say that's a chapter point there and there. Say OK. All right. 
now we're going to create a menu so here I'm going to select a menu from the menu list again we can modify the title make it bigger say play video make that bigger modify as we wish now when we select the edit page here we can change the background music for our DVD and we can also change the background image or background video so I'm going to select one of the balloon pictures say this one alright and there we've replaced the picture now you can see there are black bars here very easy just click stretch the background okay and there we have our menu okay now we're going to modify the chapter menu so we'll select a different background for that so this one again stretch chapter 1 chapter 2 that's okay we can hide that object it doesn't fit in there really and now we can preview our DVD click play alright there's the DVD there's the thumbnail click play now we have our second menu transitioning in and then we can select our first chapter and start the movie play okay and when we're done we click next and now very simply we insert a blank DVD into our drive click burn and it will start burning our DVD